Hello today's video we have the following content. The secrets of the new dramas in October are revealed. Which one is your first choice for chasing dramas? The National Day holiday is finally here. Are you looking forward to a lot of time to relax? At this time, the list of new dramas on IKIE is released, which is really eye-catching. Handsome men and beautiful women gather together, it is simply a visual feast. But the question is, which one is worth chasing? Let's talk about Seven Nights of Snow first. This drama is scheduled to be released on October 9th, starring Lee Kin and Zhang Shunxi. I heard that this drama has elements of ancient costume martial arts, and the plot is full of stories about seeking medicine for friends and getting along day and night. It is really ups and downs, especially the kind of sadomasochism that depends on life and death, which makes people excited just thinking about it. Who doesn't want to see the emotional entanglement between the unruly swordsman and the cold medicine king valley master? Next is The Great Dream Returns, which will be broadcast in late October, starring Hao Ming Heo and Chen Dealing. This drama is a good fantasy adventure drama, with monster cases and teamwork, which sounds like playing a game. What kind of sparks will the combination of Hao Ming Heo's black belly demon and the cold goddess create? Are you all looking forward to this wonderful journey of monsters want to catch demons? Let's talk about Winter Solstice, which will also be broadcast in late October, starring Wang Jing Gaiu and Sun Jin. Urban suspense themes always make people feel mysterious and attractive. Especially the plot of the reunion of former lovers, and I heard that there are serial murders, which is like a suspense novel. Such a setting is about to come out, and I want to find out. There is also Your Lies Are Beautiful, which is scheduled to be broadcast in mid-October, and the combination of Chen Zingxu and Zhang Yuxi is also expected. This is a drama about urban love, the combination of medical rescue in the film and television industry, which really incorporates various elements of modern life. Zhang Yuxi's beauty and Chen Zingxu's black belly will surely stage a wonderful duel between lies and sincerity. Taking advantage of the National Day holiday, everyone can watch the drama at home. These new dramas are all powerful collaborations, and they are definitely worth watching. Which one are you most looking forward to? Leave a message in the comment section and let's chat together. Next news. Wang Xinghai's first fairy tale drama has been launched, and it is reported that he will lead with Li Landi, and Zhuan Lu and Li Yunru will join. In the past two years, Wang Xinghai has quickly achieved a double harvest of word of mouth and popularity in the field of costume dramas, and has become a top tier young actor loved by the majority of audiences in the current entertainment circle. Whether it is the image of a crazy and black-bellied prince or the image of a powerful minister with a clear wind and moon, he can perfectly control it. In addition, Wang Zhengyu's fighting scenes are clean and neat, and his emotions are relaxed and moderate, which gives each character a soul. It is precisely because Wang Zhengyu has a very high position in the costume drama market that the scripts he received are almost all large-scale costume productions. For example, Ding Feng Bo, Tang Palace Strange Case, Phoenix Feather Order and so on. Among them, the work Tang Palace Strange Case has invited Bai Lu, which means that Wang Zhengyu and Bai Lu will soon wear costumes for the third time. At present, Tang Palace Strange Case has been confirmed by Yu Sheng, and if nothing unexpected happens, it will start filming at the end of November this year. In addition, Wang Zhengyu has also received an invitation to the fairy tale drama Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains, which is expected to bring a brand new role experience to the audience. Wang Xinghai's first fairy tale drama was reported to be led by Li Landi, and Zhuan Lu and Li Yunru joined. As we all know, Wang Xinghai's previous costume works were either power struggle dramas or house fighting dramas. But in the field of fairy tale dramas, Wang Xinghai has not yet appeared in any representative works. Once Wang Xinghai takes over the work Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains, it will successfully refresh the audience's inherent perception of him. The work Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains mainly tells the story of the smart girl who is Iang Wen, who must turn to a Taoist who practices the Sword of Love in order to improve her skills, but she falls in love with Zi Changji who practices the Sword of Questioning the Heart at first sight, and starts a story of love and killing. Because the male protagonist had no lust in the early stage and was a person who did not understand love, when the female protagonist's meridians were destroyed, she could only hear the male protagonist's expressionless apology. From then on, the heroine faked her death and escaped, transforming into the young master of Hehuan Palace, only to find that the hero turned to practicing the sword of affection and directly found her to reunite in various ways. From the perspective of the plot setting, Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains has great potential for a hit, and it brings out the elements of sadomasochism to the fullest. 
The most interesting thing is that the narrative perspective of Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains is very unique. In the past, the heroines of fairy tale dramas almost all did not understand love, but this drama is the opposite, which will definitely make the audience shine. From the perspective of character setting, the role of Zi Changji is completely tailor-made for Wang Zingayu. In the play, the hero is a Taoist who does not understand love, is cold and arrogant, and is strict with himself in the early stage. In the later stage, the hero is an affectionate, high-spirited and straight-ball love-chasing image. I believe that with Wang Zingayu's appearance and acting skills, it will definitely bring a pleasant drama-chasing experience to the audience. At the same time, the heroine setting of Sword Seeking Thousand Mountains is also very suitable for Li Landi. In the early stage, the heroine who is Yang Wen was quirky, like a moth to a flame, stubborn and determined. She can be regarded as an image of a pure love girl. In the later stage, after the heroine recognized the ruthless nature of the hero, she saw things clearly, woke up in time, and avenged her enemies. She can be regarded as an image of a heroine with great ideas. Such an interesting and powerful heroine will definitely infinitely magnify Li Landi's personal charm. In addition, Li Landi has delicate and smart eyes and a deep foundation in lines. She will definitely interpret the agility and transparency of the role of Huizai Yang when just right. In addition, the Sword Searching Thousands of Mountains drama party also extended an olive branch to Xuan Lu and Li Yunru, two high-value actors. With their joining, the work Sword Searching Thousands of Mountains will be more topical and interesting. Let us wait and see together. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 